Hi, I'm Becca, and today I'm going to show you how you would add logic to your Pavlovia surveys. So in this example, we're going to present our participant with an information sheet. Um, this is actually um, a survey that we created in our previous video where we showed how to add HTML content to a Pavlovia survey. All I've done is I've also added a title information sheet and also my institutional logo at the top. What I'm now going to do is I'm going to ask my participant if they've read the information sheet, do they consent to take part? And if they say yes to this, then I'm going to present them with some further questions about their demographics. However, I don't want to ask those questions if they don't consent to take part. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to first of all scroll to the very bottom of my survey and I'm going to add a question and that question type is going to be a checkbox. And all I'm going to say is uh, please tick all that apply. Now my options here are going to be I have read and understood the information sheet. I'm also going to say I am aged over 18 and I consent to take part. Now what I can also see on the right hand side is the various settings about this question. So if I select general, I can change the question name to instead be um, consent. That will be how that's saved to my data file. So it's important that that question name makes sense. And then if I scroll down, I can see choices and I can see how each of those items is going to be referred to. So let's also update those. So I'm going to say red underscore info. Then I'm going to say um, age 18. And then I'm going to say consent given. Lovely. OK, now let's say if my participant checks all these boxes, then I'm going to ask them a further question. So I'm adding a further question here and I'm going to say, how old are you in years? And here I do want a single input, but I only want to allow numeric responses. So I'll first of all just change the question name on the side. I'll say age in years or underscore years. And I'm going to change the input type to be a number. Now here, let's say the maximum value I'll allow will be 100 and the minimum value will be 18 because I've already asked, are you aged over 18? Now, if I scroll further down here, there is the tab called logic. And here there is the option visible if. So I'm going to select this little wand icon on the side. And what I want to do is make this visible if in that consent question, my participant has selected all of those options. And then I click apply. And there we have it. This question should only be presented if my participant selects um, all of these previous options. If I want to check that, I can preview my survey before I launch it. So I'm going to make sure I save my survey. I'm going to go to this preview tab here. And there I can see I've got my information sheet and I'm going to select all of these options. And then you can see how old are you in years appears on the bottom there. And there we have it, logical presentation of questions in your Pavlovia survey.